This is a Hof infrared flamer. Uh, it's a little bit different than some of the open flamers that you might be used to seeing in the past. Uh, this particular uh, unit is manufactured in Holland. It was specifically developed for organic agriculture there. What makes this unit a little bit different than some of the open flamers is, is the contained heads that have a, uh, a high efficiency burner and then they have the polished chromed deflection plates that deflect the heat from the flamers down towards the ground. Even though it's called an infrared burner, it's somewhat of a misnomer. It's infrared from the standpoint that it is using reflective technology to reflect that heat back to, down to the ground. And this is so that it can trap the heat in a very specific confined area and not let it out. Uh, saves heat, makes it more efficient, and brings the temperature underneath this hood up more rapidly uh, and keeps it at a uniform, uh, uniform high temperature throughout the use of the equipment. This is basically the brains of the, uh, of the equipment. Uh, with the automatic ignition, it's really a, a safety factor. Uh, the grower can sit at his tractor, control the amount of gas that's going in, as well as uh, controlling the ignition system, which turns the flame on and off. Uh, much safer than having to go back with a lit match and try to light your burners. And then we've got, um, we've got three different uh, lights here to, uh, to monitor what's going on. The failure light comes on when uh, the burners, any of the burners would shut off. Um, and then just the ignition green light and the gas green light to just ensure that both of those systems are working. We initially looked at this technology to uh, destroy foliage on top of uh, young plants in the fall for a disease control method and then we have started to use this for weed control in the spring. 